Shania Twain is set to take to the iconic pyramid stage at Glastonbury on Sunday, June 30th after bagging the coveted legend slot. The Canadian singer-songwriter and queen of country pop, 58, has sold more than 100 million records, making her one of the best-selling artists of all time. However, her dizzying heights of success have also come with struggles, most notably a devastating 20-year health battle with Lyme disease. From regularly blacking out to fearing she may never sing again, the star has been candid about the hurdles she's faced, as well as the comeback that meant she could step on a stage once again. Here, Mail Online looks into the health crisis that left the country music legend mourning her own voice. Shania contracted the tick-borne illness back in 2003 after being bit by a tick while horseback riding in a forest, just before she was about to go on tour. The singer was experiencing symptoms while performing on the $87 M grossing, 113 date out tour before she was diagnosed. At first, doctors couldn't put their finger on what was causing the issues. Recalling the scary experience in her 2022 rock doc, Not Just a Girl, Shania said, My symptoms were quite scary because before I was diagnosed, I was on stage very dizzy. I was losing my balance. I was afraid I was going to fall off the stage. I was having these very, very, very millisecond blackouts, but regularly, every minute or every 30 seconds. Shania has previously spoken about how it can take some time for the effects of a tick bite to appear in blood work, and by the time she received her diagnosis, her vocal cords were already damaged. Shania's voice was damaged by the effects of dysphonia as a result of the disease. Dysphonia refers to having an abnormal voice, with an alteration in its quality. The star said, it was devastating. I felt I had no other choice but to just accept it, and that I would never sing again. I was mourning the expression of my voice. She revealed that it was a depressing time when she thought she might not be able to take to the stage again, so instead put a lot of her efforts into songwriting. But that don't impress me much hitmaker, who then spent several years getting her voice back on track also confessed that looking back she thought she would never be able to release another album again. After relearning how to sing using physical therapy and vocal warm-ups, Shania released her album now in 2017, which was her first in 15 years. Shania eventually found a doctor who was able to help her by operating on her vocal cord, and so she underwent open-throat surgery in 2018, something she feared would further impact her singing abilities. Appearing on The Graham Norton Show in February 2023, she reflected on the surgery. The queen of country pop explained, The operation was very invasive, and I've got a big scar that I am proud of. I'm very happy to have a scar rather than no voice. The surgery was a miracle, and I am so grateful. Going back into a studio after the operation was a discovery and I was relearning my voice. Shania released her album now in 2017, which was her first in 15 years. Then, following her operation and after taking some time away from the spotlight to recover, Shania made her music come back, complete with a new gravelly tone to her voice, which she now believes is kinda sexy. Six years after her operation, the star released the album Queen of Me in 2023, which she describes as very happy, inspired, and celebratory.